Welcome back to The Road Show. This morning in the buzz brought to you by The Comedy Connection. We hope you have uh, your Father's Day gift figured out. But <laughs> if you don't, it may not take much planning to uh, give him the best day. That's right. According to an online study, the number one thing fathers want is to sleep in or take a nap. That's is that right. What you want? Uh, look, I can nap like nobody's business. I said it this morning. I can nap. I sleep better napping than I do all night long. Oh no way! Oh yeah, like if I if I nap, and as I've gotten older, I found myself. You know, usually, you know, when you're younger, you'll take a nap, you'll yeah. lay down. Now I find myself watching TV, and you know, you're getting old <laughs> because you find yourself watching TV, and my head just goes. <sighs> I love you know, it. back and I'm sound asleep. That's what we know. My kids do. They take photos of me sleeping with my oh, mouth nice. open, and then they just text away. Nice. And that's Mac great. gets involved too. But I, a nap is the number one thing that dads want yeah, to yeah. do for Father's a nap Day. Is a, a nap is a, is, a, is a good thing. Next on the list, a nice dinner, mm. followed by playing video games. I was never a video, video game, game guy. No, I, I wish I was, but I'm, I'm not a video game guy. And quality time with the kids, and that would also be, be you know, something, something nice. You know, I hear these guys saying, you know, they want to be left alone. I don't want to be left, left alone. Yeah, absolutely. I'd be happy if the kids were. You know, if the kids were the home. kids were home. Yeah. So what about this? A date night, okay, a sweet card, and a break from chores or other things that guys obviously would like for Father's right. Day, along with guilt-free TV time. I have no guilt when I'm watching. <laughs> <laughs> or going to a sporting event or receiving a homemade gift. Right. What um, are those? All of those. Well, so you know, I was saying to, to Brendan this morning that that my kids made. You know, when you're the, you're in grammar school and you make like you know arts and crafts for Father's yeah. Day. I've saved all this stuff. Yeah. Because I've sweet. also noticed that the older I get, the more sentimental and a mush ball that, that I am. Yeah. That I am. Like it, at the drop of a hat, I'm getting teary eyed. Oh, yeah, I love that. Yeah, that's what's happened. Well, what, what, like, what is the number one thing that you want for Father's Day this year? Uh, well, this year, this year, you know what? It, it, I was saying this morning, the last, the past year or so has been, you know, somewhat tough with with a lot of things that have that have been going on. Um, so th I want, I want some sort of like peace, it, and, and I know it sounds mushy, but like just like some sort of like ease. You want an easy day? Yeah, I do. Some peace. Yeah, I do. I want yeah. some sort of peace. Yeah, that's right. that's what I want. It sounds sentimental and mushy, but but no, that's, but that's what that's, you want. No, it is. Absolutely. That's what I want. Yeah, absolutely. That's what I want. It's like the best gift of all. Yeah, I really do. Because, I mean, it's, it's like, how much stuff do I need? Yeah, no, I know. I got a lot of, you know, George Carlin said, you need a place for your stuff. And do the girls still get you stuff on their own? Or is no. it? No. Okay. <laughs> I'm sure. Okay. I'm like, okay, so that doesn't stop. <laughs> no. 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 I'm, I'm sure in some, like, if a gift comes to me, <laughs> I'm sure in some roundabout oh, way. Right. I pay, I, I pay for it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So you buy yourself everything well, for Mother's Day. Right, right. I'm sure that's no what different it is. than Mother's Day. Even at Christmas time, I know a couple of years ago they went and got gifts. Well, they got gifts because they had a credit card that I paid for and bought the gifts for on that credit They're card. They're like this. Yes. He can get oh, whatever they, he wants. Like, oh, look, here's, here's a gift. I'm like, yeah, but I paid for it. <laughs> <laughs> Happy oh, Father's Day, it. right? Oh, That's it. There you go. All right, we're going to check it with Brendan. I've reached a point in my life, speaking of napping, where I am now waking myself up by the sound of my own snoring. Yes. It's disgusting. Yes. But yes. that's, I'm an old man it now. It's disgusting. I, it is. It's gross. Snoring, lawn, right. the next for you guys. <laughs> I can go into like such a deep sleep that when you do yeah. wake up, you know, you have that feeling like, oh my God, I'm late for school. Yeah. You know, yes. when I'm 53 years old. Yeah. You know? Yeah. 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 Right. Now, yeah. <laughs> With regard to Father's Day, my father, who I miss more than anything yes. on this planet, yes, this will be yes, my yes. second one without him, right. and he's, I just miss him terribly, but I have so many fantastic memories, it would be the same thing. I don't want anything. Don't get me anything right. for Father's Day. Well, if Will and Audrey, my brother, and I had heeded this decree, <laughs> We would have had to have had our passports ready for the guilt trip we would yes. have been taken on right. for this because you know you got to get dad something. Sure, you got to yeah. do it, right? Will, yeah. come on. I, I think your daughters really ought to get you something. <laughs> Where's my credit card? <laughs> do something for dear old dad. Let's right. check in with our viewers. See what you had to say about this topic right here this morning. Joseph's up first, and it's very simple: a happy day with the family. <laughs> Guilt-free. <laughs> Will Giltbert. Yes. I was working on that over here as well, yeah. Moving on, Michelle adds, maybe a nice day playing golf. Nothing wrong with that. Not for Will, he doesn't golf. <laughs> David shares a lovely sentiment just to be with your kids and perhaps grandkids. And Dante puts a perfect dad day into perspective, a large steak and a mowed lawn. I'm telling you, there's nothing like that I'm freshly like manicured grass, right? Thanks for chiming in, everyone. And please keep those comments coming, and we might use them right here on the show. It's very exciting. You know, people come up to me all the time, they say. <laughs> 
Right. Tony Petrarca. <laughs> How can I get my name on the show? Well, follow us at The Road Show. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Leave your thoughts and comments, and you never know. I, Tony Petrarca, may read them right here on the show. <laughs> It was very different in person. Still to come this morning on the Road Show. Summer travel numbers, they are up. How you can travel smarter, discover new places, and maximize your vacation. Coming up next on Maxim. You're watching the Road Show on this Friday morning. We're back right after this.